Hi guys, welcome to a new vlog. Thank you for coming back if you have, and thank you for those who have subscribed. I appreciate you guys so much. Um, in to, ow, oh my god, I almost ate it. In today's video, we're going to be doing just, it's going to be a weekly vlog, like a week in my life, kind of. It's going to be really chaotic because, again, don't know how to edit, so I pray for you guys. But we're going to go to Target, we go to the museum, Maya and I go to the museum. Um, I'm also going to my chiropractor, we're going to the Asian market, I'm so excited. I do my nails, I'm going to do them at home, hopefully I get some good clips because, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> And then right now, we're just getting ready for the day. Like I said, I have my chiropractor appointment later. Um, I have another appointment with HR, um, kind of, I don't really know, um, for work. But yeah, right now we're just gonna get ready. Um, if you see a red spot, I don't know if it's still there. Um, but I did just get my eyes, my shots for my eyes. Um, so I go to a retinal specialist, so I got them done on Friday, and there was like a red spot. So if you see a red spot in my eyes, um, don't mind me. Also, I'm using this e.l.f. skin, the Sun Touchable Woe Glow. I don't know, it's sun protection and makeup primer, so I'm going to use that, but hello? Hello. Do you want to come out? There you go. Should I just put this like on my face with my hands? How does this work? I don't know. This match, hopefully. I was doing treatments for that, which is what I got, got done on Friday. I was doing um, injections for that. I, I go to the retinal specialist and he does injections. Um, and it's actually not as bad. Like I thought it was going to be really bad, but I really hope this looks good, y'all. Sorry. Um, I thought it was gonna be a lot worse than like what it is because um, obviously injections in your eyes does not sound fun at all. So I was really scared. So I did that for like my treatments. I had six of them, I believe. Um, and y'all, it was scary. Um, you also don't really see i'm being dramatic you don't see the like injections like you don't see the shots coming he tells you to like look down and look into the corner and hope i'm on the other side but now now <laughs> um i have to he's telling me that the next treatment or like the next course is <clears throat> laser Let that sink in. Laser. I actually really like this. So yeah, laser. And I'm scared for that. I really am. Because I don't know. I mean, I've gone through like labor and, you know, all that. So I feel like I shouldn't be scared. But it's just a scary concept to like your eyes are so I was telling my grandpa this because he was like you know what you just need to be confident you just need to like believe that everything is going to be okay and I was like I can believe all I want but <clears throat> the fact of the matter is I could still like what if they mess up my eyes but then again I want LASIK surgery eventually so like I shouldn't be that scared um but yeah, <laughs> I don't know. I'm just like terrified. <laughs> I'm terrified of it. So if any of you are also type 1 diabetic and have gone through this, I mean, I've talked to my friend um, who's gone through this treatment as well. And she said it just feels like a, what is it? Um, like a rubber band snapping on your eye, which I feel like I can, I don't know. I'm tough. I can deal with that. Maybe. I don't know. Um, so let me know if you guys, if any of you are type 1 diabetic and, cause girl, I'm scared, I'm scared, but like, also I don't want anything to get worse than it is, you know, if that makes sense. Like I don't, oh, I just made a mess. Um, 
I don't know. I just, <laughs> okay, we're not, let's ignore that. Let's ignore that I just, I can't see, okay? I need to do a lash lift on myself because my lashes are so embarrassing. Like they really are. They just stick like straight out. Like they're gonna stab somebody because she'd be like looking like a naked mole rat <gasps> before i got my eyebrows tattooed girl <clears throat> excuse me girl i literally looked like a naked mole rat i looked like the one from kim possible i kid you not i really did which like hey we don't judge no shame but on me mm -mm. no girl i need to find myself a man okay a man I can't be looking like a naked mole rat. Oh, I got it on my nose. Oh, I hate that. <laughs> I feel like I just rubbed off my makeup right there. It's fine. Whatever. We're going to deal with it. Okay, so we have finished the makeup look. The natural makeup, no makeup. Is that what they call it? Is that what the kids say nowadays? I don't know. But anyways, we finished. And this is what it's looking like. I actually really did like that e.l.f. skin sunscreen thing. I liked it. It was cute. And now we're going to go to the Asian market. You guys, we are here. Yay, let's go in. Yes. You guys, I got one of these. I got strawberry milk. But they literally have like every Okay guys, we literally, or not we, I don't know why I keep saying we, it's just me, but I just got home from the Asian market and I got some stuff. So I bought one, two, three, four, five, five things. And I spent $17, $17.85, which I don't think that's bad. Um, especially because one of the things in specific I got, um, well, you'll see, but I will use them like more than for more than one meal. So that's worth it alone. So the first things that I got, because I'm hungry, I haven't eaten yet. So the first things I got were chips. So these are my favorite. These are absolutely amazing. They are the Calbee, I think I'm saying that right, Calbee potato chips, seaweed and salt. So they are my favorite. We love those. These are another favorite of mine. These are also Calbee. I clearly like Calbee, like the brand. These are shrimp chips. They're baked shrimp chips. You need to try them. They're so good. And then these are from Maya, actually. Again, I didn't realize, but they are also Calbee. They're like a, a veggie chip, um, it looks like. But they're in the shape of little hearts. How cute. <gasps> That's so cute. I can't. So I got those from Maya. I really hope she likes them because, I mean, I'll eat them either way, but I hope she likes them because... That will be a good little snack a for her. And then I also got this um, spicy nong, nong. I'm not going to try to say it. It's a shin noodle and it's like a microwavable one. So I got that. Also, I know the glare is so annoying in my glasses, but um, there's nothing I can do about it. So um, bear with me. Anyways, I got that and I'm really excited for that. I actually might make these with the spring rolls that I'm going to make because I usually make it like a top ramen anyways and I put it in my spring rolls. You guys, it's amazing. I put noodles, I put, what is it called? Spam, lettuce, carrots, and cucumber. It's literally so good. If you like all those things, you need to try it when you make your... Well, when I make the regular ramen, I put in the seasoning packet and I put in a little bit of cheese. You guys need to try it. It is so good. Try it like that. Make your little rolls. Roll it. Oh, with a little bit of peanut sauce. You guys, it's so good. Okay, and then I got, sorry, it came in this bag. 
And then I got a strawberry milk. Strawberries blended with real milk. So I didn't read the real milk part. <laughs> so I'm a little scared because I'm lactose intoler intolerant. Lact Anyways, you know what I mean. So I got that. We shall see. But I mean, it looked really good. So I'm going to try it. And then what I went to the market for was my three ladies so this is my favorite brand that i've tried um it's the three ladies brand literally that's that's the name of it three ladies brand and it's like the medium size wrap there's ones that are excuse me <laughs> there's ones that are smaller than this and then there was one that was a lot bigger that i've never seen before but i've always seen the little ones these are the perfect size if you're making spring rolls with a lot of ingredients in them you need to make you need to use these ones 350 for it doesn't say how many are in here but these are amazing so i'm gonna go ahead and make myself my lunch because i haven't eaten yet today and i'm really hungry i think i might be hangry because i was yelling and honking at people not honking my mom would get mad but i'm i was yelling at people in my car in silence because i'm hangry so i need to eat and snack but I'll see you guys in the next clip. That's the one that I got the last time. I, I mowed on. I mean, I mowed on this one. Hi guys, so we just went to Target and tell me why they have the popcorn now at my Target. And I was just telling my mom that it's giving me a nostalgia of when we were, I was younger and we would always go to Ventura and they always had like the popcorn and the food, the pizza, they had pizza, huh? Um, and it, it totally gives me nostalgia of when I was younger and we would always go to the Target out of our city. And I also got this Starbucks drink. It was, it's a pink drink with lavender or was it lavender like lavender cold foam oh my gosh this was so good it was i know i just told you guys in my other video that i would never pay six dollars for a tall drink but i had to because it was so good i had to try it the guy was really they're talking really good things about it so anyways maya wants to say hi and I wanted to do a little Target haul. I get usually groceries, but I did get a few things that were obviously not groceries. So, we did get two things of strawberries because they were on sale for $2.50. And when they're on sale and they're looking good, I definitely try to get more of them. And if I, for some reason, don't finish them, which we usually do because Maya and I both love strawberries, um, I just cut them up and I freeze them. So. Either way, I feel like I'm getting a good deal. I did get the Swedish meatball lean cuisine. I actually really like this one, especially for days where I'm at work, like I'm in the office. I like to um, buy those. I got two of these. These are actually my favorite. These are the mini chopped kit. It's a Caesar salad and they're my favorite. I love these ones. The little crunchy croutons that come in them are so good. So I got two of those, two of them. I did get one of these. These are also my favorite. What I do with these is I get my rice, which I, I think I bought a bag of rice. Um, so I usually get rice, I get this, and I either make chicken or I'll make um, tofu and I'll put it all together and put some soy sauce on top and it's so good. So I bought one of those and I usually split this into two meals um, and I just put it in my air fryer. So love that. I love anything that can go into the air fryer because it's so easy. My air fryer is actually right there. So I did get these for Maya. She loves these. I do like to usually get the, go is it Gogurt? The little like cupped couple ones, couple ones, like cups, 
Um, I love those because they're a lot cheaper and you got a lot more. These ones are like $5 and you only get four, which it's still a good deal because it's only a dollar, like something per couch. But. And then I saw that they had these on sale. They're originally like $6 and I'm sorry, but I'm not spending $6 on these. It's the cold foam. So this one is in French vanilla, but yeah, it's a cold foam creamer. So I thought that was really cool in a can. You just, it's literally like a um, like the whipped cream, the spray whipped cream. So it's in one of these canisters and um, you just put it on to your coffee. And now that I have my little coffee machine, um, I feel like that would be so good. And I'm an iced coffee girly. Let me know below what kind of coffee you like. Do you like your coffee hot or do you like it cold? I am a cold coffee girly. We did get some honey nut. Oh my God, did I get honey? Yeah. Cause you know, there's a difference between the regular Cheerios and then the honey nut Cheerios. Maya only likes the honey nut Cheerio ones. So we got that, that was our first bag. Oh my God, Jesus. <laughs> it was so heavy. I also got some bread so that Maya can eat her bread. Oh, you cleaned it? Good job. Mm -hmm. um, and then, I, like I said, I really like this brand, the Bird's Eye. And so I did get this one. This one is Cheddar Broccoli Bake. And I probably will put this one in the, uh, really like this one. Um, I mean, it says you can put it in the microwave, but I probably will put it in the oven. So. This is Maya's favorite one. It's the spaghetti with meat sauce. Yeah, 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 that's my favorite one. She loves this one. I so like got, it. This is the rice that I use. I mean, I'm telling you guys, I like it super simple. Um, I like to make my life easier, and I don't cook, okay? Don't judge me. I don't judge you, but I don't cook. Um, so I get this 90-second jasmine rice. It's literally the best bagged rice I have ever had. It's so good. I just throw... Okay, thank you. I just throw a little bit, like the tiniest bit of butter, mix it in, and I microwave it. So, love that one. And this one specifically, I really like the jasmine rice. This big old thing of tangerines. It was only like three something, so I was like, absolutely. And I actually really like these too, so they're not just for Maya. I will eat these as well. Um, I am making potato salad for Easter tomorrow so I did get two potatoes we do have three already so we're good with that I also got the rice long grain rice because my mom was complaining that I don't have any like rice like this so she was like you need to get some rice so I did we also got milk for Maya the last bag I'm a sucker for the dollar section so I did get this mini air pump especially with summer coming I feel like I will use this a lot for all of the like pool toys um, and like floaties that we have so I got that I thought that was a really good deal that one was five dollars oh there's more groceries in here I got this because it was on sale and I love this. It's um, the oven roasted turkey breast. So I got this. I usually put this on anything. I'll put them on my rice cakes with some lettuce and cheese and I'll just have like a little like sandwich on my rice cake for the rice cakes from Trader Joe's. They're like little square ones. They're really good. And then I keep the container for like if people ever come over and there's leftovers that they wanna take home. I keep the container and I just take off the label because it's super easy to take off. So that's a hack. Buy these, save the containers, and use them for when people take food, like leftovers, home. I got a cucumber because Maya literally loves cucumbers. She will eat it like raw if I just peel the thing or whatever. She'll eat it just like that. She loves the cucumbers. And then I'm actually doing this haul so that I can make this for her really quick. Um, this is her favorite soup. It's the... Um, Italian style wedding soup and this used to be my 
literal favorite soup because I used to, or they used to have this at Albertsons. Was it Albertsons or Vons? But when I was younger, they used to have it at one of those um, grocery stores, like in the actual like hot pot section. And they had the wedding Italian wedding soup. And I used to get it all the time, especially when I was sick. So it's very like nostalgic for me. And so Maya loves it now too. So I did get two of those because again, they were on sale for two for $4. So I got those and then I'm type 1 diabetic as you guys might know from my last video so I always like to have a Gatorade in the fridge for when I'm having a low blood sugar because if I don't then I either there's two situations I either have no like easy fast foods for me to eat when I'm going when I'm going through a low or I just eat, if I do have stuff, I just eat like the entire fridge and that's real dangerous. So yeah, Gatorade it is for me because I have no self-control when I'm having a low blood sugar. And then I did get this, it's the e.l.f. It's the e.l.f. Um, Sun Touchable Low Glow, the Sun Protection and Makeup Primer. So I did get this. I got it in sheer peach sh shimmer, sunbeam. I don't know. I got this one because I need some, you know, um, sunscreen. It's SPF 30, so I don't know. I thought it was good. And you guys know from my last video, I don't know how to do makeup. So let me know if you guys used it, used it, or if you guys like it. And then the last thing that I got was this for somebody um for their easter basket so yeah i got that and that's it that's my grocery haul <laughs> thanks for coming to my grocery haul i hope you guys enjoyed and i'll see you in the next clip